Hi everyone, welcome to Email Picks. It's Kyota here, and I've just come back from a meeting with a client. We were discussing the results of our training program and also what to do in the next training term. But towards the end of the meeting, our client mentioned that they were thinking of starting a so called owned media. Owned media are things like a company blog or a company radio station, things like that. But they said that they had no experience making any owned media, so they had no idea where to start. They also said that they were looking for a consulting firm or a vendor that could help them get started with their own media. And then we ran out of time and we had to go. Now, actually, I know a very good web marketing consulting firm, so I thought I should refer them to our client. So, in my email today, I need to do two things. One, I need, to, I need to explain why I'm recommending this firm to our client. And number two, I need to ask our client if they would like me to take the next step, which is to give their contact information to the consulting firm. So, let's see what that email will look like. Hello, Ms. Higgs. Thank you for taking time out of your day to meet with us. We will proceed to the next step as we agreed during the meeting. In regards to your search for an own media consultancy, I happen to have worked with an excellent firm called Rookie Inc. They taught me how to run a successful company blog a few years ago, and they are now one of the leading companies in the industry. If you are interested in seeing how they can help your company, I can ask their salesperson to contact you. Please let me know what you think, Kyota. Okay. So, in my first paragraph, I'm doing a brief follow up on the meeting we just had. In the second paragraph, as you can see, I'm saying many good things about the consulting firm. The phrase, I happen to have worked with an excellent firm, means, what a coincidence, I have actually worked with an excellent firm. Okay, so I'm making the message sound a little more special by using the phrase, I happen to. In my final paragraph, I'm asking for permission to pass on Ms. Higgs's contact information to the consulting firm. So, there you go an email to refer a vendor to a client. See, new business happens only when people meet new people, so maybe this will help our client in some way. Maybe. Anyway, that's it for today. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next week.